Hello everybody, this is Toys R Us and for this new blocky figure review we're going to be looking at Thundercracker but before we look at the figure himself let's have a quick look at the packaging. First and foremost we've got the huge box, yes that's right you can buy them in boxes if you want rather than an individual and this is the packaging for that. The outer artwork there is fantastic. For those of you unaware these are licensed by Hasbro and Takara so they are an official product that is why they can use the likenesses and their correct names which is again fantastic. The individual box boxes that they come in look at this just beautiful the sheen on it the reflectiveness reminds me of when i was a kid and used to get them stickers or the foils or the shinies whatever you want to refer to them as uh, they come in these little boxes and they come with quite a few things which i'm going to show you uh, in a second first and foremost check out the time lapse video of the quick assembly of this fun little build figure So there we go then. That's again as simple as it is, but it's fun. It's really fun to do these. And when you get these in your hand, they're just, again, they just look great. Let me just get rid of the reflection and the glare from that box because I want you to see the detail on this little guy. So, so stunning. The head sculpt is brilliant. Full articulation will look around side to side up and down etc the arms are ball and socket so obviously you can do the full t if you need to the wings you can't really move as you saw they're probably attached but you've still got more than enough range of motion and articulation on this to do lots of different things you've got flexion in the bicep as well as a swivel same as with the fists you can actually change the fists i'm going to show you that in a second the waist doesn't it should do yes it does it's quite stiff you do get a full waist rotation you've also got ball and sockets um, at the hip so you can go full splits that way nearly full splits the other way it does just kind of get caught by the hip skirts which is absolutely fine though there's a swivel at the top of the knee bottom of the thigh and you've got an ankle tilt and rock as well so fully fully articulate i've got him with i can't call him null rays because obviously they're obviously uh just prone to be for star screen but the little blasters on the arms which look great the other stuff that comes inside the packaging is he's got a stand as i say he's got a separate set of hands if you wanted to have a look at them you can see they're very simple ball and socket you were just nice and simply pop them off like that and then replace with the one that you wanted to um, there's the little stand which is really good you can see it says blockies on the front and then you've got to line these up in them parts there the stand works brilliantly you can really pose these in quite crazy ways and they just completely hold no issue whatsoever mini little i don't know if it's like a collector's card it reminds me of a pog funnily enough uh, but i'm going to keep hold of that and that might be useful for you guys if it works when you scan um I, all my videos are out of order completely for the reason that obviously i did skywarp first which was great and then i actually um ended up doing uh ratchet uh next but i wanted to do the complete step-by-step -step build the review for him will be up soon i just wanted to show you this particular guy there so that's three of them so far i'm really looking forward to getting through all of these because they're just exactly that there's so much fun what we're going to do is that's a generation one of course redeco which looks really really nice you can see the homage to that and there of course is one of your more up-to-date figures so there you go there he is there is thundercracker the little blockies figure let me know what you think of him in the comments these are fun guys they are proper fun um and again they're small so they don't take up too much space many more of these coming up on the channel let me know what you think in the comments take care